It's been more than one year since Keith Winkowski experienced intense foot pain, a common symptom of painful diabetic neuropathy. His pain was so severe, going barefoot was out of the question. I can now go to a beach and walk on the sand without feeling like uh, I'm working, walking on glass. The reduction of his pain came after taking part in a Northwestern Medicine study. He received two rounds of human hepatocyte growth factor gene therapy injections in his legs. We inject the patients with a non-viral, this has nothing to do with the virus, way of having muscle cells start producing this growth factor and secreting it in the leg. Patients like Keith, who received a low dose of the therapy, reported a 50% reduction of pain versus those who received a placebo. We didn't just reduce the pain then. The reduction in pain was found at three months, at six months, at nine months, and then the pain now is, the patient is almost more than a year out. He still has reduction pain. So the, the effect of the treatment stayed for longer than we expected it to stay which is really amazing. Keith was diagnosed with type 1 diabetes more than two decades ago, but the numbness in his feet and fingertips were fairly new symptoms for which there is no effective treatment. Currently, the things we do right now just treat symptoms, and then we hope the body can heal itself. This would actually be helping the body heal itself. If we can show that this is a very real phenomena, that in fact, with more patients, we reliably and reproducibly can do that. Then what we've shown is that we've not only reduced the symptoms of the disease, namely the pain, but we've actually improved function. That is, we're regenerating a previously lost function. A much larger phase three study is planned. In the meantime, Keith is hopeful that his participation in this study has a lasting effect on his condition. I'm hoping uh, that the, uh, the effects that I'm feeling do not um, do not cease.